Hey YouTube, it's Mitch at iPhoneCaptain.com. Today we're going to be doing the top 10 free tweaks for the week. Today is September 3rd, so let's go ahead and get started. The first one we're looking at here is called Resume. What this does, it simply lets your music continue playing if you have resprung or re rebooted your device. So I'm going to go ahead and respring here. I'm going, first of all, I'm going to turn the music on. Uh, so let's go ahead and turn the music on. Okay, you hear that it is playing. So now when we respring, it'll go off and I'm not going to do anything and it should continue playing once the device has come back from a respring. I'm not going to cut the video out at all. We're just going to sit here and let it respring. And as you heard, it already continued playing that fast. It's called resume. The next one is a music tweak also. It's called hashtag play me too. There was a hashtag play me that we did a few months back this is the part two and updated version and this too is a pretty awesome little tweak so what this does if you are um, listening to music whether it be on Pandora or in your music app or wherever it will cycle through the artist as well as the name of the song and on this one here I'm gonna open up Pandora just to show you that it does work for it as well Okay, and up here in the status bar, you see I just died in your arms, and that's what we're listening to in Pandora. That's called hashtag play me to play task. And what this does, it lets you play and pause directly from the app switcher. You see, I'm just flipping that on and off. If you want to start and play your music from your app switcher and there is a play button that go that you can enable to go in the center of that card and you can change the color of that play button if you wish to but that's called play task the next one we're going to look at guys is called colorful HD I'm sorry colorful KBD and this is a keyboard tweak so I'm gonna go ahead and open up the notes app here we have the keyboard now they are sort of a purple looking color. If you turn it in portrait, they go just like a light blue. Turn it back. Each time you turn it, they're going to change colors. They're sort of a darker purple this time. Now the now the uh, they're they're the color it was in landscape in the portrait position. Now turn it back in landscape, and now they're red. If you like this style, guys, check it out. It's a pretty cool tweak, and it is free. It's called Colorful KVD. The next one is called Lumos. If you use your flashlight a whole lot, then this puts a little light bulb right here at the bottom corner of your lock screen. All you have to do is tap it and it will turn it on. Tap it again and it will turn it off. Okay, that easy. Now you can reposition that anywhere you want to on the lock screen, so keep that in mind. Pretty cool, Lumos. All right, guys, the next one is called Wipe Tracks. If you surf the internet, your Safari or whatever, and you don't want folks knowing where you've been, Wipe Tracks will help you plan that special birthday party without getting caught. It does not record any of your history is what it boils down to. So if that's something you think you could use, it's called Wipe Tracks. Okay? The next one is called FB No Need Messenger. What this does is it eliminates the need for you to install Messenger. You can still use the old time Facebook message apps. And let me take this off here just so there's nothing uh, sensitive showing. Uh, what this does, guys, is pretty cool. It allows you to continue using your Facebook apps. Okay, I can just blur it out. Now you see down here is my messages and here's all the people that's messaged me and you see if I wanted to message any of those I could just tap one of those and it pops right up inside the Facebook message app. I don't have to go into messenger that's called FB no need messenger. There's nothing to configure no settings or anything. The next one is called Raspberry. What Raspberry does it allows you to align your status bar items to the left or to the right so when you go into settings it's going to be called 
something different. So keep that in mind. It's going to be called right align status. Now, if you want to align everything to the right, you just turn that on. And now everything will be shifted to the right. And as you can see, that is definitely the case up here. And if you open up Safari or anything like that, it does come back to the center. Everything aligns up when you come into an app, I think is the way it works. That's the way it's working for me anyway. So if you wanted to align everything to the left, you could turn that on and then switch to the left. And that's called Raspberry. The next one, guys, is called Ghost Prefs. This is a Snapchat tweak, and it adds several awesome features to Snapchat. And if you want to Snapchat me, I'm iPhone Captain. Feel free to snap me all you want to. Uh, I will reply back to you. And inside here, you go to Ghost Prefs, and you'll see that you've got many new added features recipient alerts you can enable and disable things in here if you don't want added features is right here is look what a list here's one I like add from camera roll you can snap people photographs that you have on your device you don't have to take it right there and then snap it uh, you got save all text messages no character limits you got all sorts of awesome things never show the start snap timer and one of my all-time favorites on here is the uh, never log out. You know, originally you have to log in Snapchat every time you use it. This keeps you logged in. Pretty cool, guys. Definitely one you want to check out. Another awesome one, guys, is called Message Enhancer. I've had a lot of people asking me how I get the picture of my uh people I'm talking to in my conversations and let me take a look and make sure there's nothing sensitive here and I'll take you in and show you what it is I'm talking about right here if while I'm inside of the app you'll see right here that there's a picture of me on the left and right both whoever you're talking to will be in there that's coming through message enhancer and if you go into message enhancer uh, settings you see you got a long list of different things you got contact photos and list contact photos and conversation that's what i have too and you got some more things that you can use here if you want to if you want to enable wider message bubbles you can do that if you want to hide things like separators search bars uh camera buttons chevrons and all that it does require respring if you change anything so keep that in mind Guys, that's 10 awesome tweaks. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up. It really helps us a great deal. Hit that subscribe button if you aren't already, and keep coming back.